Hey guys, welcome back to M6 Trains. Today we're going to be taking a look at this brand new MTH Premier CSX-8 Narrow Nose, number 7550. Starting out here at the front of the engine, we're going to start down low. You have a very nicely detailed pilot with nice hoses and ditch lights, and of course a separately applied coupler cup bar. Coming up, you have some nice handrails with some safety chain. This is in the YN2 paint scheme, which is very nice. Nice stickers on here. That door does open, by the way. Sand caps as well. Nice white roof. The trucks are very nicely detailed. Coming down the side. Nice detailed fuel tank. See through grills. And again, the rear truck, which is nicely detailed. And some more grills back here. Taking a look at the back of the engine, you can see that nice rear truck detail, as well as the rest of the rear of the engine. You have reverse lights, some more handrail details. Very nice back here as well. Lots of things to look at. Up top, you have a removable cover, which will reveal your controls and volume and smoke and stuff like that. It just pops back on by magnets. Moving back, you have a nice smoke unit that puts out a good amount of smoke. Separately applied horn. Some more molded and separately applied details. And again, there's that nice white roof. And here's a nice shot of that nose, which looks pretty cool and unique, which is why I really like this engine a lot. On the other side of the engine, we are looking at a ton of separately applied, uh, I call them stickers, but they're decals for different things. These say danger, high voltage. Some of them you can read. Um, some of them are kind of blurry depending on how good your eyes are or if we had a magnifying glass. Um, but there's a, a ton of nice green details on this side. There's that truck again. Back here at the fuel tank, there's your bell fuel gauge meter right there. That red paint makes it pop, which looks nice. More screen details. I really like that wine two paint. More decals. And there's the rear. All those grills. Looks really nice. All right guys, that about wraps it up for this review. This is a great engine. It looks really nice. Tons of detail. Lots of things to look at. Um, I'm going to run this around the little loop of track here. Let you hear the sounds. Uh, thank you guys for watching. Take care. Have a good day.
hate to interrupt this video, but unfortunately for some reason this engine does not like the curves on this little loop of track for some reason. Um, but don't worry, I will get a running session of this running at the club layout. Hopefully it performs better. For some reason it keeps stops and shuts down. I don't know why, I guess it's the track, but I'm gonna add a little clip of the freight sounds real quick for you guys. Uh, like I said, hope you enjoy. Sorry about that, but you will see this run at the club, so don't worry. Thanks, guys. Wow, it's a hot one today. Good thing the AC unit is working great. Glad for that. Once we get closer to the yard, it'll be even hotter outside. Well, hopefully we get to the yard by late morning. Don't forget that track warrant is in effect at milepost 20 on our way back. Thanks for reminding me. I really don't feel up to baking in the sun all afternoon. Southbound Z train to Flagman. Flagman answering southbound Z train. We are uh, stopped at your stop sign at milepost 37, waiting for your instructions to proceed south. Roger that southbound Z train. The Green Crossing and Removal Project at Street Road is being worked on, and they have a crane lifting steel for the new overpass to close to the right of way. Okay, Flagman, we will stand by for further orders. Southbound Z out. Those guys work fast. No matter what the elements are, they're out there making sure the railroad is running smoothly. True, but I'm sure they'll be wrapping up soon. They started way before dawn this morning. How many auto racks do we have to drop off today? 30 auto racks and they are all at the end of the train. The rest of the train are all piggybacks for the intermobile facility. That's not too bad. We should be in and out if no one's in our way. And even better if they had a brakeman to make the cut for us so you don't have to. I hope so, because if I don't work with the sweat now, once we get to the yard, I'm going to have a lot of walking to do. Flagman to Southbound Z train. This is Southbound Z. Go ahead, Flagman. You have permission to pass my stop sign. All personnel and equipment are off the track, and you are okay through at track speed. Roger that, Flagman. Southbound Z out. Okay, let's nice this baby up and get on down the line. <laughs> 